All right, now we're in the transaction. Okay, we're going to duplicate the first wall type, right? And now it's going to be new wall type is equal to first wall type dot duplicate. And we're going to name it new wall as wall type. Now we're going to go grab the material the material to go off of, so we can apply it to our new wall type. And now it's going to be, we're going to get the element ID of it. We're going to call it old layer material ID. That Y. All right, and that's going to be equal to first wall type dot get compound structure dot get layers. And then we're going to grab the first and only, in this case, dot material from there. And layers, open, close, and then it's going to be, there we go dot material ID. Okay. All right. Once that's done, we're going to come down to our dimensions, right? And so basic dimensions, right? Uh, for an inch, well, inch zero. This one's not really too important, but it's gonna be uh, double inch zero equal to zero point zero, and then. I'll just lay out a couple of ones. So this one's going to be, I'm going to give you the 5 eighths in which you can figure out from there, and then 1 inch and 2 inch, right? So for 5 eighths inch, it's going to, I'm, I'm going to name mine inch 6 to 5. It's going to be equal to open, open 5.0 divided by, it's going to be 8.0 because it's 5 eighths. All right, and then it's going to be close divided by 12. Okay. All right, and then for one inch, it's going to be name my double inch one. You can use whatever you want, but uh, it's just going to be 1.0 divided by 12.0, and then double inch two is equal to. 2.0 slash 12.0. Oh, all right. And you guys can figure out the rest from there if you guys need like a half inch or an eighth of an inch or whatever. Okay. Uh, now we're going to set the wall structure. All right, guys. And then to set the, uh, the I guess we'll call them layers that we're putting in, right? Uh, this is how we do it. So we're going to grab compound structure. I'm going to call mine exterior. Oops, EXT layer finish one. And then say new compound structure. And we need to give it dimensions. That's going to be, I'm going to give mine one inch, comma. And then we need to give it material assignment. So if it's like a finish or um, structure or membrane, whatever. Uh, that's going to be material function assignment dot finish one. Okay, I believe a uh, finish one is exterior, and then finish two is interior. Right, uh, so this is me. Finish one, and then um, we need uh, we need to assign a material. So we're gonna give it the old material ID, which is just the by category general. You know, the one that's pretty general and relevant. All right, and then let's see this compound structure needs to be compound structure layer. Ooh. And this also needs to be layer as well. Okay, cool. Great. Uh, we can go ahead and duplicate this a couple times. So in this case, I'm going to give mine three times. And this one I'm going to name to uh, layer membrane. And this one I'm going to name substrate. and both of them get ones at the end, okay.
and then I'm gonna give my membrane. The membrane needs to be zero, FYI. Um, if you don't know what membrane is, then it's a, uh, if memory serves me correctly, um, it's like, uh, in this case, I think would be like a Tyvek type of thing. So like waterproofing stuff, All right? So this is, since it's super thin, right? It needs to be a zero, okay? And then material assignment, and that's gonna be membrane. And then give it the old material ID. If you want later on, you can go on and figure out all the materials IDs and then you can go through this and figure that out. Okay. Uh, for the substrate, um, I'm gonna give mine a 5 8 inch. Looks like I named mine incorrectly. And I did. And if we're gonna rename something, it's just Control R, Control R R while holding down Control, and you can change it to whatever you want. So I'm gonna name mine two five. Okay, great. And then come over here and change that to substrate. Okay, and same with the material ID. Okay, uh, and now we're going to. So I'm gonna seem like this is the middle. Kind of helps me envision it as I'm making it. And then for the interior side, and it's going to be uh, pretty similar to this. We can just copy these guys. Let's see. Paste, paste. And then this one name is interior layer. Int layer membrane 2. Okay. And then this one's going to be and layer finish two. Okay. And then these ones I'm going to give, again, membranes need to be zeros, right? So inch zero. And this guy's going to be two inches thick. And again with this membrane. And this is going to be finish two. Okay. And they're going to get the same materials at the end. All right. Now we're done with that. Now we're going to grab the new wall type compound structure. And to do that, we're going to do compound structure, compound structure, equal to new wall type, and say get compound structure. Okay. And then we're going to add some layers to that. And first we need to create a layer, so we're going to do I list compound structure, compound structure layer, layer is equal to compound structure dot get layers. All right, all right guys, and to set the layers, we're going to do, uh, grab our list that we did, right? We're just going to do layers dot insert and we are inserting in position zero, comma, exterior layer finish one, all right? And then we can duplicate this. And to duplicate, if I just, I'm just hitting control D to do it, all right? And he's gonna go in position one. And this guy's gonna go in position two. And this guy's going to go in position four. And this one's going to go in position five. Okay. Uh, and then I'm going to show you guys how the inserting of this works. If you're new to coding, it's the same thing as um, uh, inserting uh, things into lists, right? So you can do like list.add. Uh, you know, adding position to it. Okay. Let me pause the video so I can show you that right now. Hey guys, that's gonna be it for part two. Uh, thanks for watching. Uh, these videos are getting kind of long, so I try to keep them down to between like, ten to fifteen minutes long. Uh, don't forget when you're watching to you know watch at two times speed so you can learn faster and you know try to get through I guess the quote unquote mundane stuff sooner and faster. Um, yeah. All right. So uh, if you like the video, um, please like and subscribe. You know, subscribe really. Subscribing really helps me out. Uh, and then uh, and go ahead and check out uh, part three, where we, where, where we will be finishing uh, the project or the button. All right, see you guys there.